May God bless us. May God do so many things for us. May he always be there in our time of need. In my life, I have problems. I have problems. So, if you are trying to live for Jesus Christ, if you are striving for perfection, believe it, you are going to have problems. But what I can say, even though I have problems, everything may not be right in my life, so to speak, but at the same time, God is answering prayers in my life. I can focus on the bad things that are happening in my life, but why not focus on the good? And to be quite honest, The bad may seem like it is overwhelming my life, I guess. But if I sit down and take note about the good things in my life, I believe there is more good than bad in my life. And if you are living for Jesus Christ, I believe the same goes for you as well. We may not take note of particular things because we may take it for granted. Yes, I have problems in my life, but I can breathe. I don't have a disease. No cancer, no diabetes, none of that stuff. Like, I can walk around. I can move around. So many good things are happening in my life. But if I were to place a magnifying glass on my life, so to speak, and if I primarily focus on that, yes, then it may seem my life is so horrible, blah, 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 but it is not. Good things are happening in my life. Bad things as well, but the good overwhelms the bad. Now, I can make the bad, I can make it seem like the bad is so much stronger than the good, but it is not. What we should do is focus less on the bad in our lives and focus more on the good. There was something I have been praying for, for a long time. I would say a long time. And I truly believe it has been answered. And it is very, very shocking. But at the same time, bad things are happening in my life. Should, so should I feel down? Should I feel sad every day because of the bad and not take note of the good? Yes, good things are happening, but that is no big deal. Why? Because I still have problems in my life. So since I still have problems in my life, I am not going to appreciate the good that is happening in my life. That is foolishness. That is ignorance. Like, how do you think God will feel? He is doing things for you, but you choose to not appreciate it because he is allowing bad things to happen to you. Appreciate the good that is happening in your life. I believe in all of our lives, if you look real good, 
I believe you will see good things in your life. If you can walk around, if you can complain, and if you can do all this stuff here, I'm not saying complaining is good, but if you can move around and stuff like that, that is good. If you have the ability to speak, that is good. Aren't there people who can't speak? Aren't there deaf, deaf people out there? Aren't there people with horrible, horrible diseases out there? So if you are not saying that your body is completely well intact, but I am telling you, things that you take for granted, look at them and appreciate them. I think anyone can focus on the bad things happening in their lives. I think one of the problems we have, I think many of us love pity parties, playing the victim. Why are these things happening to me? Why is this happening to me? Why is that happening to me? I don't deserve that. I don't deserve this. How do you know what you don't deserve? How do you know? According to your thoughts? According to your feelings? No. Appreciate what God has done in your life. Even if it may seem insignificant to you, for instance, if you can walk around, it may seem insignificant to you, but I believe for a person who can't walk or a person, yeah, a person who can't walk, a person who has been laid on a bed who can't really move, I bet if that person, I believe if that person is blessed with movement as you, I believe they will be so, so excited. But you may take it for granted because it is something you may have been able to do for a while now. So because it is an everyday thing for you, you may take it for granted. And that is not good thinking. So let me stop here. May God bless you.